It's Judy Vitale, your Read the Stars Astrologer, here with another video. Um, the date is Friday, March 25th, and you know, I kind of get did you guys a disservice, I think, because I only talked a little bit about the Sagittarius moon, and I said, well, it'll make us happier, because we've been so uh, morose, and I've been particularly morose because of some things that I have to deal with in terms of the planets, but I just really said, oh, we're going to be happy and wonderful. I forgot about something that has to do with Sagittarius, and that is, in addition to being very jovial, sweet, and nice, Sagittarius is always looking for the truth and will argue and fight for his or her version of the truth to the death. I mean, literally, to the death. Well, I saw it bursting out all over the place today. Most of all, uh, you know, sometimes when I'm writing and I kind of need a little break, you know, how you kind of get distracted and I'll go to Facebook. Where else would one go? And I swear there were more arguments on Facebook just like for innocuous comments. Um, you could say, I agree, and somebody will come back with you. Well, I didn't mean that. And just, Whoa. Well, I haven't even read it yet. It's so long because I've been so busy. But I have a diatribe of, I don't know if it's a diatribe or not, I don't know what it is, but there's a very long conversation on my Facebook page that I have to go look at. <laughs> and it has to do with people arguing over um, an incident that happened on the subway. And there, were, there was a woman sitting by herself and these two other women sitting together. And one of the two women sitting together was eating a thing of spaghetti out of a pot, and the other one got really ticked off, the you know, lady on the other side of the subway, you know, how dare you eat on my train. And then she got ticked off because the lady said that, and then an argument ensued. And I just thought it was very funny, and I was looking at the funny side of Sagittarius, and I put it up there. And then, you know, everybody started to chime in on it. And I thought, too, I said, since when did everybody volunteer to become the police, you know? And that's sort of what the moon in Sagittarius does. And then I thought, gee, who do we know who has the moon in Sagittarius that's kind of newsy and can really, you know, personify what the moon in Sagittarius is? Now, the moon in Sagittarius also is someone who very impulsively just says whatever is on his or her mind. They don't mean to be nasty and they don't mean to be insulting, but they don't think before they speak. And so oftentimes it comes out and then they have a bigger controversy than they had in the beginning. Well, it turns out that our friend Donald Trump has the moon in Sagittarius. Not a surprise. I mean, obviously he's a Leo rising guy. You can kind of tell by the hair. And he's a Gemini by his sun sign. So there's an article up there on the site about Donald Trump and his Sagittarius moon and some of the things he's said lately and the fact that he may run for President of the United States. So, um, I don't know how that's going to turn out. I always thought Bill Gates would run for office, and who knows, he yet might, I and mean, we have time. <laughs> it could get even crazier than it already is out there. So, um, that's what's going on today. I wanted to let you know, and, and again, invite your questions, your comments, suggestions. Judy, J-U-D-I, at readthestars.com.